I cannot believe it, you guys. My audio has betrayed me. Oh, great. This again. Yay. The face cam preview is not working, which means the face cam might not be working either. Hey guys, Nate Will is here, and welcome back to some more Dormitabis. So yeah, I said I was going to do another video of this game, and I will be, but unfortunately, I tried to do another um, a recording of this again, but the audio for the game didn't record at all, and I don't feel like going back and doing Night 2 all over again. So all, all I did was beat Night uh, 2 anyways, and it took me like a million attempts, and I also unlocked um, a new character, or a couple new characters. We have uh, Havoc Chica and Am I Real here. We also unlocked a tape, which we're gonna. I already know what it, what happens when you play it, so we're gonna listen to it again, anyways. It's a shame. A shame. A shame. I didn't really want to do this. I didn't want to start doing this again. But they just won't shut up about it. It's not my fault. I can't control my physical mutations. It's not like anyone ever cared for the truth. All they ever wanted was to harm me. But this will be the end. Not without consequences. I'm going to be recording the most important parts of my plans here. As a reminder. For myself. Okay, so I still have no idea who was talking there, but... We're not actually going to be worrying about the whole, you know, route of getting all the tapes. I'm guessing that leads to a different ending, but we're going to be doing that in a separate playthrough. Here we go into this night. Uh, okay, I'm back again. I'm going to hurry this right. time, mostly because they're probably pretty active right now. Now there's a right. big mess of parts and stuff that has appeared only after you first arrive. It appears to have lamps in it, and for some reason, it's full of sharp teeth. It looks like something straight out of a goddamn horror attraction, to be honest. Uh, anyway, once it's assembled all of the parts, it is going to appear on your ceiling. Uh. I think the best way to just keep it away. What is that is thing? It's up there, so make sure to do that. It dislikes being watched. Oh my oh, god, yeah, what is that plasma thing? Source issue. Uh, the old plasma source that was used to create these messed up ghosts is, uh, it's still around here. Oh, it great. It's there. Play dead. Play dead. Look at the ceiling and do absolutely nothing until you hear it walk away. That okay. Is the only way to keep it out. It, uh, it doesn't like other ghosts. I've seen it attack the others multiple times, actually. Oh. It's pretty interesting. It appears to walk backwards there. Uh, well, I'm gonna leave you to it. Uh, what is that don't thing? Don't about collecting the tapes. Heard that. Let's go hide. Now, apparently, I've been doing this kind of wrong the whole time. Oh, God. Someone's here. And I think I know who it is. Where are you? Oh, my God! Hi! Okay, you left. I thought it was Cupcake. Um, because in the previous episode, I got killed by Havoc Cupcake. Seven? I think he said seven. Oh, never mind. Three! And, okay, am I real is currently normal. Alright, now he's all broken again, so we, we shall stare at him. So yeah, that's the way am I real works. Basically, he'll say what camera he's actually going to, but it's really hard to understand what he's actually saying with his voice, but he will say what camera he's going to, so you have to go that to, you have to go to that camera. And if he looks all withered and bro- if he looks like Springtrap, you need to basically keep that camera open until he turns back into his normal form, which is basically a bear, so, yeah. But yeah, the way this works is if Havoc Freddy appears back here, he can't actually... Three. He can't actually kill me from from there at all, so basically I don't really have to do anything if he's there. I just have to ignore him, pretty much. Now, the cupcake that he has, on the other hand, or not, the cupcake that Havoc, Fr or that, um... Am I real has sometimes. I still don't know how that thing works. I'm guessing because in the when I was doing night two, this there were some times when the uh, screen actually blinked, and it only happened once. But the screen blinked, and then suddenly I got jump scared by him. 
when the screen blinked, I immediately ran back over to the other side of the office. But then I got killed by a cupcake, so I'm guessing that means maybe he appears on the desk or something when the screen blinks. The screen blinking means someone has entered, doesn't... Um, I'm guessing it's either Cupcake or whoever the guy up there is called. Oh, okay, so we don't need to worry about Freddy at all, I think. And if I get killed, I am going to break my screen. You should, you know, leave. You're kind of ugly, my dude. I'm no offense or anything, but you, you're kind of ugly. I don't want, I don't want you. Now that, on the other hand, was someone. I think we're good now, all right, so I'll head back. Thankfully, Am I Real is still there, and Havoc Freddy is gone. With how many attempts it took me to beat night two, I'm not sure if we're actually going to beat this night or not. we got like three more hours left to live. The ambience has went silent. The ambience going silent, I'm guessing, doesn't mean anything. Unlike in uh, Five Nights at Treasure Island 2017, where it meant that Minnie was about to attack. It's very interesting how the tape player is actually sitting over there. I'm still not going to be looking for the tapes at all, though, right now. I'm going to save that for a whole different... We're going to do, like... Again, I'm guessing it's like FNAF 3's good ending, where... I'm guessing if we get all of the tapes, it kind of leads to a different ending or something. Either that or it's just a little extra thing for you to learn more of the storyline. I will be doing it in a separate video, though, most likely. Assuming I actually decide to. Because I usually don't end up doing that. Like... With Simulacra, I think it had like four endings, but I only got. You interrupted me, sir. Most of the characters. <gasps> yes, okay. That noise plays right before we get a jump scare as well, so it either plays once you beat the night and once you get a jump scare. So that's a clever way. We actually beat night three in one try. Maybe we should we do night four as well then? Well, let's have a look at the extras first. See if we unlock anything new. The soul cage. Not much is known about this monstrosity. When alive, the kid's name was Jake. I think it's ugly. And this is Molten Evil. You look like Shadow Bonnie. I never saw you, by the way. A poor spring-like victim that was used by the puppet for the manifestation experiments. Four. The game has a total of uh, 12 nights, and God knows how hard the 12th night is going to be. I'm probably never going to beat it either. I mean, I said I wanted to do a full playthrough of this game, but at the same time... Good evening, John. If you're still alive. Uh, I have good news and bad news for you. The voice sounds different now. Alright. Yay! I'm sure this character is something from the location we had back in 87, or uh, at least something similar to it. It's a puppet, but it's full of these disgusting, slimy tentacles. Oh. If it appears in the window behind you, just look at it. And it should go back to where it came from. Tomorrow, there's okay. another active enemy that has something new for you to watch out for. And Toggle the... That one might be the hardest to take care of. But for now, make sure you get through the night. I'm gonna try and get you in on the plan in that anyway, enemy tomorrow, since I'm running out of time. There's a robot fox around me somewhere, and I'm pretty sure if I don't cover myself, he's not gonna allow me to ever send you any message again. Oh. Okay, that scared me. Uh, oh god. Okay, am I real? I'm pretty sure he makes that noise when he enters or leaves Cam 1. I don't know what the laughing means, but I know what the door opening means. Oh, Chica! Oh. Oh god, three, he said. Okay, you better be gone. Clear and clear. Three. Oh yeah. An an Dude, the music. <laughs> it worked. So when that music starts playing, that means the puppet is right there. That's the same music that was playing in the opening cutscene of the game with the purple guy. I remember that. I hear that. Oh my god. Go away, please. You look very ugly. You just, you don't even have a body. You just have tentacles and a head. I'm surprised, uh, the, um, Shadow Bonnie thing and the thing that hangs from the ceiling. I don't remember what their names are anymore. Have, I'm surprised they haven't appeared yet. 4 a.m.? We're doing good. Oh my 
Wait, that's not my ra Where did he go? Am I dead? Did he just leave right away? Nope! Let's see who kills me this time! Come on. Good evening, John. Yeah, I already... I... Um, I'm not sure if you guys can tell. The headphones might not even be recording the audio again. I'm gonna upload this episode whether they record it or not. But, uh, oh god. The game audio is... has been severely... There you are. Um... I've just barely heard that. I heard a door moving. Barely. I barely heard the puppet's music. The audio has been turned down a lot for some reason. I think I pressed the hang up button and it now all the audio is much quieter and I can't hear crap. Yes, my headphones are currently low on battery. I might have to play without headphones. Oh god, where did he go? Oh my god, screw it. Just kill me, honestly. Just kill me. I need to charge my headphones anyways and I need to get the sound fixed. And unfortunately, I never really bothered to record any more Dormitabas that day because I just didn't feel like it. So, that's going to do it for this episode of Dormitabas. Um, I know I was going to do Complete Night 4 as well in that video, but I never did, so I only got Night 3 done. We're going to do night, Nights 4 and hopefully 5 as well in the next video. Um, but, yeah, I just really wanted to get a video out, so if this video seems a little bit rushed... Since the edits, um, I'm not really going to do any of the usual edits, which is why the quality for the video is not going to be in 720 at all. Um, the only edits you're really going to see is jump cuts, so, uh, yeah, I just, I really wanted to get, I need, really needed to get a video out today, so yeah, peace out. I'm not going to do a question of the video for this video, um, peace out.